Hey everybody, this is just a quick look at a Bob Dozier knife that I have. It was given to me as a gift by a friend a few years ago. I forget the model number. It's titanium scales, sort of like a Sebenza, and a D2 blade. I guess there aren't many of these made by Dozier. You can find it if you look it up on his website. It turns out it's a really, really nice knife. Flow through design. You get the one pin in the rear. And then the pivot pin. And it is a frame lock with a detent. You can see the ball. D2 blade. Thumb stud. The light choil on the blade. And some jimping, of course, on the back. And it looks like it's very thin like that wouldn't be much of a help but uh honestly once you get this in your hand it locks pretty well the blade's a good old drop point design by dozier hollow ground it is uh if you read his site if you ever go on he says he prefers very very thin edges as it makes them easier to resharpen and to maintain an edge in the field there's light beveling up at the top it's not not quite a swedge, he just knocks the edge off the D2. I find it to be nice. The spine, they leave that sharp edge on, which I find great for popping the top off beer bottles. And, uh, see if I can catch how this hollow is. Let's see if you guys can see as I roll the edge how much he hollows that out. You can see it's a very, very thin edge. It's nice, holds an edge forever. You wouldn't think it would be in so thin, but it does. The thing that makes this knife, see if I can get a better light here, the lock, of course, is angled so as it wears, if it ever does, it will still stay tight. The lockup is superb. And it's not Sebenza good, but it's good. The thing that makes this unique is, if you notice, there's no stop pin. It has another sort of frame lock stop pin and I think he calls it a tab lock and it fits wonderfully it doesn't affect at all the opening or closing on the knife you wouldn't even know what was there it's just kind of a neat feature so we got the frame lock and the tab lock and those are the only things holding the blade where they belong other than the pivot pin and it is tight. The pocket clip leaves a little to be desired. It's tight. It works well. You don't lose it. It doesn't tear up your pants, but it's just a little short. If you look at the overall knife, I prefer it to be a little flatter in dimension to the handle and a little bit longer. But honestly, it works very well. I mean, I can't complain about the guy's designs. He does a very nice job on everything I've seen. And if you like his stuff, and I tell you, if you can get a blade like this, it's just a cutter. Get the K-Bar versions of his knives. They're very inexpensive. They work very well. And I haven't heard anything bad about them. And the fit and the finish on this is outstanding. So here you go. See if I can get it. It says D2004 Dozier underneath the arrow. So... Nothing printed on this side other than the D2 to specify the blade steel. And it's quite a knife. It's quite a knife. Just a quick look. I thought you guys might like it. I don't have any technical specs to give anything more. The blade, I'm going to say, is uh, 3 inches. Let's see, I got something else here. Uh, very similar in size to a... I think it's a barricade by Benchman. I can't even remember the name. Barrage, barricade, barricade, assisted knife. You see the length is very similar. So if any of you guys have one of those, let me see if I can straighten them up. If any of you guys have one of those, give you an idea of the size of the blade. I'm going to say this is three, and I'm going to say this is just under. But I could be talking out my butt. Handles a little longer. Or what else I got here? For all you uh, sack guys, that'll give you an idea. 
that's a pretty large knife in my opinion for your pocket handle wise it's almost the same as that sack but it just sure don't feel like it because it's so thin well what else do I have handy Put it next to another titanium. Give you an idea. Yeah, bad filmmaking, I know, but I'm no pro. Blade length shorter than your large Sabenza. The height of the blade is very similar grind to your eye looks quite a bit the same but this is more of a drop than that is in my opinion or clip they spear this up some it looks nice so it gives you my two titanium folders that i have handy i'm not going to pull them in handy out of the case all right guys that's the dozier hope you enjoyed the vid and uh stay safe